Hi! Today's video is inspired by one of our community members, Brannon. He says, how to get the copier to work on multiple MetaTrader 4? Also how to keep it connected for a long time possible. First of all, thank you Brannon, that is such an important question indeed. To facilitate the answer for you and for all our viewers, we will show you an example. Right here, I have multiple accounts activated and ready to be used. To add them to the copier, we simply copy and paste the account number. According to how many accounts you have purchased, you will have them here. In the drop-down menu, we can select the account in which we want to copy Telegram channels and execute signals to. Now let's head to our MetaTrader 4. Here we can see all the connected accounts. Let us try executing some signals from each of them. There is no option to know from which account the signal has executed, but we can remember the name of the channel we have connected instead. What I mean is, we can remember which channel is in which account so we can know that the account is working perfectly. And, here you go, everything seems to run smoothly. As you can see, the signal forwarded from the M15 channel has executed nicely. Now let's try selecting one channel in each MetaTrader at a time and see if it works. We begin with the first account. We hit the Save button and refresh the EA. Now, let us execute the same signal. And voila! Now let's try the second account. The same process. Of course, you can have as many accounts as you want, there is no limitation to Telegram FX Copier's exceptional features. And here you go. Telegram FX Copier is one of the best Telegram to MetaTrader 4 and 5 copiers. Fast, reliable, smart, and effective. If you're watching this video and want to give it a try, which I highly advise you to do if you are a beginner or advanced trader, you will find all the links in the description. As for the next question, how to keep Telegram FX Copier connected for a long time possible. You will have to keep your laptop on, or you can use VPS for that matter. That is all for this video. We will see you next time.